Hello and welcome to Broken Law Low. Now, as you can see from on here, this game is actually the prelude to the previous Broken Law games, which was Unfollow and Follow, which surprisingly isn't on here. Um, so yeah, um, this is the prelude to the other games, where it's set in Japan, which I think, and don't quote me on this because I'm not too sure, but I think the other games are set in America? Um, I don't really know. So. This is possibly the origins of it. I don't really know. I, I'm not quite sure on how this story works. It's a very confusing series. We are three games in, actually four, as you can clearly see here. There is another game that came out with another demo on here. So there are four games with five demos, as Unvolo had two different demos. And we just keep on getting these stories. It's very confusing. I don't know what's happening. But I want to see what's going on more with it. So we're going to find out. And if you want to continue down this rabbit hole of demos, link, as always, will be in the description below. I really hope you enjoy it. And as always, thank you in advance for watching. But let's see what this episode part Hello, love. of the story is. Hello, Naomi, has. how are you? Everything okay with the trip? Yes. All under control. I'm almost there. That man, the producer. Are you sure about this meeting? I've heard strange stories about him. I know, I know, but it's just a work meeting. Nothing to worry about. I have everything under control, really. All right, but please let me know how it People goes usually say as soon as you can. And good luck, Naomi. <laughs> Thanks, love. I'll call you as soon as I'm done. See you soon. Okay, and we are in the game with some crazy mouse sensitivity. Let's see if I can see if I can fix that. It needs to go really low down, and I'm gonna turn down the volume just a little bit more. That still feels crazy, uh, man. All the way down. That seems a little bit better. Okay, so here we are in in Silent Hill, apparently. All right. So yeah, as I was saying, this is one of the strangest game series I've ever seen. No, oh, is that for me to read? Yes, it is. At the heart of the village, they once stood a temple, and they are lost in the fog. Alright. Um, yeah, this is the third game of these games. All three of them have demos, and the first one has two demos. So technically, out of the three games, there's four demos. And, as on the home screen of this showed, there is another one in the Broken Law saga series. Um, called Don't Watch, which is completely different by the looks of it, or by the sounds of it. It's not following the unfollow tradition of using the words for it. So, I don't know what's going on with this series. It's it's so strange that there's so many different games that are just demos. Um, it tells of a woman, marked by fate, who desperately sought to escape her destiny. Carrying on? Do I need to be keeping an eye out for something? Hmm. I don't know. Whoops. It was the village chief who mapped the path of her pain, a journey with no return. Okay. Um, also, carrying on with that comment that I was making. They, so yeah, the demo for this and the other Broken Law game came out the exact same day, as well as another demo that these developers have made. So, not only do they have four games in the Broken Law saga, they have a new game, new demo of the game came out, and um, there was Bloody Crossroads, which I played, which was also from this developer. So they've brought out six games with seven demos, 
I, I don't know what's going on with it. It's so confusing. Maybe this is their, their just what they want to do. They want to keep on bringing out demos for games and build a story from that. I don't know. Rejected and slandered, the woman was unjustly accused of betrayal and dishonor. Okay, are we going to meet this woman at any point? The game looks pretty okay, from what I'm seeing. You know, it's kind of foggy. But everything looks good, even the fog. That doesn't look too bad. Hmm. Thought I could see my reflection in that, but no. Alright. I'm going to read this and I'm going to turn around and it's going to be behind me, isn't it? Well, let's see. From her death, a vengeful entity arose, cursing the village to a fate of terror and darkness. Or oh, fog. And... Oh. I wasn't expecting that. Hideki? Naomi, is that you? How's the exploration of Kirasami Mura going? <laughs> it's... Fascinating. I found some fragments of the story, the legend of the village. It seems. Ah, the ancient stories that enshroud this place are profound. I'm glad you've begun to uncover them. I invite you to lunch at the Red Lantern Izakaya. We could delve deeper into these legends and discuss your future. That would be interesting. Thank you. I'll be right there. Perfect. I look forward to it, Naomi. It'll be an enlightening meeting, I'm sure. Red Lantern. So is there going to be a building with a Red Lantern out of it? Is that what I'm looking for here? Maybe it'll light my way. I don't know if it's getting foggier or if it's... What? Well, it looks... It looks foggier. It definitely seems to be getting darker. Ah! A couple of lanterns. Did I pass this? I would have thought I would have remembered this. Hmm. I was keeping an eye on both sides of the path the whole time. Maybe it's different? I don't know. Naomi, I must say, your voice has something hypnotic. There's a depth to you that transcends music. Thank you. I hope that can come through in my performances. Oh, I'm certain it will. You know, Kirisami Mura has stories that could inspire any artist. Like that of the ancient temple. A place of mystery and forbidden passions. Forbidden passions? Sounds interesting. Oh yes, very interesting. Perhaps after our work here, I can show you some hidden parts of the village. Places that inspire a certain intimacy. Now uh, you're one of those uh, kind of producers. That would be educational, I'm sure. Uh, but uh, speaking of work, you told me I wasn't the only one invited. Uh, yes, the competition. A necessary spark for true talent. Uh, don't worry, Naomi. I'm sure you're... Uh, Uniqueness will stand out. I don't like this guy. Hello, beauty. Are you already in town? Excellent. I have a matter to attend to, and then you'll have your chance to show me your qualities. I need to prepare for the other candidate, but this evening at karaoke, it will be our special moment. Uh, I just, understand. He's so creepy. I'll see you tonight, then. I don't know if I trust him. I I don't want to call you. Stay nearby. Can I just no? I'd I'd rather just leave. Okay, I absolutely need a cigarette. Oh, 
the lighter. Oh, it must have been left in the car. Okay, I assume it went this way. Even though I don't remember passing this, but I assume it's this way. Definitely getting a little more ominous. Is it getting greyer? It's hard to tell anyway because of how much the fog is in this place, but it seems it seems like it's gotten greyer. I don't know if that's just me. It's weird. No trace of the car. Oh, this fog yeah, is too dense. I can't see anything. I was thinking that. I was thinking I didn't walk that far, did I? Um. Am I just going in a circle? I think I've ended up going in a circle. I remember that wall. So if I go back, will I see the lantern again? That'll be weird. Um, yeah, this wall again. Am I going the wrong way? Do I maybe have to go back? Oh, I'll, I'll just go around one. Ugh, I'm sure it was here. Okay. Am I going in circles? Ugh, it's like this place has swallowed every escape route. Um. Okay, Naomi, breathe. Don't let this place mess with your mind. There has to be a way out. What the fuck? Okay. This is getting really weird now. Oh, uh, hello? going on this is getting weird <laughs> this really is like Silent Hill a foggy a foggy town that Foggy town that gets you trapped. Why is there so much blood? Jesus. But yeah, foggy town that you're trapped in and there's no way out. Sounds very familiar. Are you oh. looking for something here, dear? Hi. I am. Um, I'm. I'm just a bit. Lost, I guess. Lost? Yeah, a little bit. Or maybe you're trying to find your place, like me. Hideki, the producer, has spoken a lot about you. You're the other one, right? How... How did you know that... Hideki has a nose for talent. But between you and me, only one can truly shine. And you think it will be you? <laughs> It's not a matter of thinking, dear. It's a certainty. But hey, good luck tonight. Okay, thanks. Um, I, I guess I'm just going to go this way again.
try to keep an eye if there's going to be anything I can interact with or anything. I don't know what's going on right now. Uh, getting blinded? There's the big headed thing. That's got a big head and a long neck. Is that just part of. Is that a relation? Maybe. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna run away a bit. Actually watch where I'm going. But yeah, is that actually like part of its relation or something? Like a descendant of it? get away from it. But would I kind of loop around at some point for it to be right in front of me? Or is it going to like all of a sudden catch up? Oh shit. Oh. Um. Alright. Hey. Um. There's a there's a wall. Um, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I guess I'm supposed to let you just get me, maybe. Okay, so that was Broken Law Low. Um, a little underwhelming compared to the other demos, which the first um, unfollow demo seemed like a full game itself. I would have said that was long enough and had enough things to be a game. The second demo, yeah, kind of, maybe the same. Even Follow's demo could potentially have been a short game. Lot was that seemed more like a demo. Um, it kind of seemed like there was less to it, and I don't really know how it involves in the story. Again, I'm assuming the face, the the big skull face, is something of relevance with the long neck, because this is the first time we haven't seen him in a broken law demo. So, yeah, maybe. Um, and again, there is another Broken Law game, so I'll probably be playing that very soon to see how that connects with it, um, if at all. But yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of feeling a little bit like, is the game actually going to come out? Are they just bringing out demos too many? Have they got too many things going on? I don't know. Who knows, maybe at some point they'll just combine everything together. And well, they'll bring them all out once like they did with these demos. Um, We'll have to wait and see, see what happens. Anyway, that is going to do for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, want to consider subscribing. It would mean the world to me, and it really does help out a lot. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.